Nintex Workflow Cloud has featured a Google Drive connector since the first release of the application with such actions as get a file and store a file. In November 2016, five more actions were added bringing the total of Google Drive actions to seven. There have been many functionality and performance improvements over the following years. Today, I would like to announce four new actions and even more additions to functionality. The new Google Drive actions are rename a file, rename a folder, get folder metadata and get drives. The function of the rename a file and folder actions are self-explanatory and are a welcome addition to the Google Drive action group. Nintex Workflow Cloud has had the get file metadata action for a while now which retrieves all the metadata on a file, so it was only logical to add the get folder metadata action to do the same for folders. Up until now, the Google Drive actions did not support shared drives, so only interacted with my drive. This has all changed. All actions now have a drive field where you can select the drive you would like to use with the action. The copy a file action does not only copy between folders, it now copies between drives. No need to get the file and then store the file to move it between drives anymore. This brings me to the new get drives action. For performance the drives field in each action will return the first 100 drives in your Google Workspace. If you have more than 100 drives you can use the get drives action to retrieve a list of all the drives and store them in an object for easy retrieval. Working with so many drives means that you are likely to run into duplicate file and folder names. Not to worry, we have you covered there as well. You can now reference files and folders using their file or folder ID. Got two shared drives with the same name. Well, the unique drive ID can be used in the drive field as well. With most storage solutions, when you save a file, you will get a warning advising that a file with the same name already exists. As Google Drive allows for duplicate files, we now give you the option to say yes you would like to overwrite the file or the option to say no. But not just no. We give you the option to say no, don't overwrite, but create a duplicate file instead. Well, that's what is new for the Google Drive group of actions. I am sure they will open up more scenarios for your workflows, as well as making the existing workflows more efficient if you choose to. Filing my duplicate file names between drives has become a whole lot easier. For more information about the Google Drive actions, please see the Nintex Workflow Cloud help files.